Darcy. Hey guys, what's up? It's your favorite bald-headed bitch back at it again with another video. So recently on my channel, I gave myself an Instagram baddie makeover and I feel like it went really well. But that was just the hair and makeup and I didn't really have any baddie clothes. So I decided that I needed to go shopping. And so I figured out that there are a lot of online clothing stores that sell Instagram baddie clothes. But one that really stood out to me was an online store called Princess Polly. Today's video video is sponsored by Princess Polly. Use code DARCY for 20% off. Princess Polly offers free two-day shipping for orders over $50. Plus, they offer afterpay. So instead of paying $80, you can make four easy payments of $20 instead. And when you check out, don't forget to use code DARCY to get 20% off. Now that's a good deal. So I headed right over to the Princess Polly website so I could figure out what exactly an Instagram baddie dress is like and what exactly I should order. Hold on a second, we're missing something. If we're gonna be wearing Insta baddie clothes today, we can't forget our Insta baddie ponytail. It's super important. Ugh, smells like lip gloss and big booties. Come shopping with me. So let's start scrolling through the Princess Polly website and hopefully we will find some hot new arrivals. Something that will get my rocks off. The clothes are pretty revealing, you know, not the uh, kind of stuff I usually wear, but um, I think it's time to get out of my comfort zone. Whoa, maybe not that far. Okay, let's look and see what dresses they have. This hot little red number is speaking to me, speaking to my inner hope. Oh. Whoa, oh my god, it's interactive. You better work it. <laughs> so this dress also comes in pink or black, but the red one is the most baddy one to me, so we're gonna get that one. Plus, Alex S. said the material of this dress is so nice and thick, and Alex has never steered me wrong. What other dresses do they have? Oh, this one is cute. Wait, this is the same one that we just bought, but it's in black. My bad. <gasps> What about this one? Yes, I could see myself in this one. Looks like a 90s supermodel. Who is oiling these girls up? This, this right here is a baddie outfit. Incredibly tight bike shorts, even though I don't have a bike? Check. Plain white tee? Check. Bomber jacket to keep myself warm, even though I'm wearing shorts? Check. I require all three of these items. Okay, we are grabbing this jacket. This t-shirt looks like the same one. El Basic, El Basico. <laughs> El Basico crop tee white. And I'm gonna get these shorts to complete this outfit. Oh my God, guys, I feel like a baddie already. Let's go for something a little more girly. I'm really into this skirt sweater combo. Hopefully I can find the sweater too. I really wanna look like a naughty schoolgirl in her mid twenties. I found the sweater. Not gonna lie, it looks a little, a little bit short, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Guys, I think I just found the love of my life in this dress. I'm going to live my best life in this dress and you can't stop me. I'm looking for something different. What about this t-shirt dress? If I wore an all denim outfit, would you guys still love me? We're gonna add this to the bag. Every baddie needs a bodysuit, right? Whoa, how about this one? Snake prints are pretty badass. This could definitely work. Plus, Tarsha K says, the material is beautiful and the fit is perfect. I could wear it with these pants. You know I'm a sucker for zippers. I'm gonna buy this shirt too, cause why the heck are not? This is like the other outfit, but in reverse. So I want a different bottom, maybe a skirt. Okay, how about this one? Every baddie needs a skirt with a slit up your, okay, I think we have enough things. Let's check out. kind of like this one. I really like the colors, but where would I wear this? Nowhere, because I don't leave my house. But I could wear it on Instagram. Sorry, I just had to plug my Instagram for a second. I really like the silkiness of this dress. And also, the pattern is really cute, which is why I chose it in the first place. I literally don't have anything like this at all in my wardrobe. I don't even have yellow in my wardrobe. I really like the way this dress accentuates my knees. Is that weird? Another thing I like about this dress, it has adjustable straps. Can you guys see that? Can you see the adjustable straps there? That's super important for me because I have a very short torso and if I can't adjust the straps on something, 
but you can wear this dress when you're doing all of your baddie activities. Like posing on Instagram and shopping at Princess Polly. Oh. This is my favorite outfit. Shorts are really tight. Oh my god. Insta baddies are always wearing those tight shorts. So I think we're doing this right. I have these cycling shorts on. They're actually very comfortable despite how crushingly tight they are. And they do make my butt look good. They're pretty much like Spanx basically. And I'm already wearing Spanx right now. So it's like I'm wearing double Spanx. I feel like Kim Kardashian. So I'm wearing that white t-shirt that we decided to pair it with underneath. And yes, I did already get makeup on it because I'm a failure. Do I actually have hips in these pants? Can y'all see my hips? Is that what this, is that what that is? Is that, a, is that a hip? I feel like I'm in a sausage casing and I like it. But I think my favorite part of this outfit is the jacket. I just feel really cool in it. I'm stylish, I'm fashionable, and I'm also warm. And y'all know that this beige is my color. Color and cafe And this whole outfit just screams Instagram bad. This is gonna be my go-to baddie outfit from now on. I'm so snatched right now. Ah, yeah! So the sweater is as short as it threatened to be, but good thing that I'm shorter. This is my 90s clueless moment, and I'm loving it. Everything's fine with this outfit, just as long as you don't raise your arms. How do Instagram baddies live like this? A life where you're not able to raise your arms. Tragic. I feel so cute right now. Like, I'm an innocent little schoolgirl, but I'm so bad. The material of this sweater is really nice and the skirt feels like it's really good quality. All of the clothes so far feel like they're really good quality. You know what? Instagram baddies have really good taste. I look like I'm going to my first day at Baddie Academy where good girls learn how to be bad. You know what? This is something that I would actually wear. This is cute. First day of school. Yes! A bad bitch has arisen. Okay, now we're getting into the serious baddie clothing here, okay? There's a slit in the skirt! That's how you know it's a baddie skirt when it's got the little slit there. So you know. And also, clear indicator that this is a baddie shirt, it says bang on it. And it's right across the tit, indicating that these titties are banging. All of these clothes make me feel like I'm back in 2001. Is anyone else noticing this? I feel like if I was a celebrity in 2001, this is what I would wear on a red carpet. Why did celebrities dress like that? I shot the sheriff, but I did not shoot the deputy. So like advertised, the shirt has the little ties here on the side, gives it a nice touch. This crisscross stitching, always makes you look like a badass. Plus a leather skirt? Come on, that's baddie material. Literally. Yeah, we could. Let me introduce you to some new thing. I'm in a shirt. Is it supposed to be buttoned up this much? You know what I love about this shirt is that the buttons, they're not like real buttons. They're like the little ones that you you pop together. They're, they're the little poppy buttons, like the ones they have for children. And I like that because I'm a child. This outfit's a little bit country and the last outfit was a little bit rock and roll. I feel like old McDonald. Yeah, yeah, oh, ho. Oh. Okay, you know what? We're gonna get, just get a little comfortable in this thing, you know? Just gotta, just gotta, so you just gotta stay like this forever. Instagram baddies just stay in these poses for like their whole lives. Best part about this shirt, it has breast pockets. You can put your snacks in here. Little snick snack, little snack -a rooney Okay, so I'm definitely not normally a bodysuit person, but this bodysuit is my favorite. It's so, I love it. This is a baddie outfit. Oh yeah. And these pants, so stylish, so fabulous, so comfortable. Are these real pockets? No, of course not. They look cool though.
The material of these pants is really interesting. Like I have no idea what this is made of. It feels like some sort of plastic. And once again, Princess Polly has saved the day with their adjustable straps. What is, th what is that? Is that a butt? This makes me feel like a, like a badass. Like I'm, like I just need a motorcycle jacket and then I could join a gang or something. Is that what bad bitches do? Are they gang stuff? I don't think they are. No, it's not right. This outfit makes me feel powerful. Ah, yeah. <laughs> sensor bar for this. Definitely should have gone a size up because it does not zip up in the back. But otherwise, it's a really cute dress. This is definitely an Instagram baddie dress because you can see my whole tit. If you saw me wearing this on Instagram, you would, without a shadow of a doubt, believe that I was an Instagram baddie. See, the thing about my body is that I'm really big up here and really small down here. So the dress fits down here, but it's way too tight up here. Like I literally can't even, I can't even zip it up. God. So if I size up, it would probably be a bit better. Get hard to breathe in here. Woo! Probably should use up all my oxygen. <gasps> I love the red color though. The red color is really, really pretty on my skin tone. It's really like pow, red, like a traffic light. I'm gonna stop traffic in this dress. Ha! Really liking the material of this dress as well. Very thick, very sturdy, very bad. My dad would kill me if he saw me wearing this. Good thing he's not watching, probably, I hope. Oh God. Ah, I look like a 90s supermodel. What the, am I Naomi Campbell? Uh, this is my favorite dress. This is super late 90s, early 2000s type style. I remember when all the girls were dressing like this, but I was like six years old, so I couldn't dress like that. But now it's come back around and I can. Do I have hips? Something about Princess Polly makes me have hips. As soon as you put on Instagram baddie clothes, you automatically have a butt. They give you one. If you spend $50 or more on Princess Polly, you get free shipping and also a free butt. Cause that was not there before, I'm telling you that. What the hell? Also, olive green is like my new thing. I used to think that I wouldn't look good in olive green and now I think I only look good in olive green. How the tables have turned. I literally feel like a supermodel right now. Somebody cast me in something. Somebody call Tyra Banks. This is my final form. So all of the clothes that I talked about, of course, will be in the description box below. Don't forget to use code Darcy to get 20% off. And if you make a purchase over $50, you do get free express shipping. I think one of these days I should actually do a 100% full baddie makeover with hair, outfit, dress, waxing my legs because they're super hairy and getting my nails done. Would you guys like a video like that? Let me know in the comments down below. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna go now before my roommate comes home and sees me dressed like this. I will see you guys in the next video. I love ya so, 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 so much.